today we're going to be talking about Lime Bike. Hi guys, my name is Rebecca Meyer and if you're new to this channel, first let me begin by welcoming you. I predominantly do tech reviews of gizmos and gadgets, so if that's something that you're interested in, make sure you hit that subscribe button and don't forget to ring the notification bell so you don't miss anything. All right, so today we are going to be talking about Lime Bike. What is Lime Bike? I'm not even sure to be honest with you, but I'm hoping to find out today. So if you've ever traveled to major cities like New York City or other major uh, cities in the US, you may have seen something called a city bike. And what a city bike is, is a, uh, uh, is a shareable bike that you can find at a docking station. So you can basically rent the bike for a little bit, return it to a docking station, and then go about your day. So what Lime Bike is, is a, uh, is a dockless shareable bike. What that means is you can rent it, leave it at, at any location that you like as long as bikes are allowed to be parked there, and then go about your day. So um, I had heard about it recently and I was like, wow, man, that's a fantastic idea. I wonder if they have it in this awesome little city that I live in called Delray Beach. So I actually opened the app and I did find one, although when I went to the website, it said that it's not quite in this area yet. However, every time that I look at it uh, or look, look on the app, I do see it available in my area. So I don't know if you remember the, the old days. I don't even know if anyone's still doing it called geocaching where you kind of like you find some coordinates and then you uh, go see if you can find it. So that's going to be the goal today to uh, see if I can actually locate one of these line bikes. Um, what makes Lime Bike pretty cool is that uh, it not only offers like three different types of bikes, but it also offers electric uh, options as well as far as electric bikes and electric scooters. And you know I love my kick scooters. So, um, so let's go see what we can find. So I'm just a few blocks away according to the app, um, so we'll see what happens. Um, it's an awesome city to walk around anyway, so if nothing happens, then nothing happens. I don't know if you can see this, um, I think I'm about eight blocks away from uh, the Lime Bike. Alright, wish me luck. All right, so it looks like I'm getting a little bit closer. Um, sorry about all the noise and the wind, but uh, I live near the beach and I live in a city. <laughs> actually, this is kind of something cool in my city. We actually have our own uh, tennis stadium here and all the professionals actually do play uh, like once or twice a year. There's a big uh, tennis tournament. So if tennis is your thing, Delray Beach is probably your thing too. This is really cool. Lots of murals around here as well. All right, so I've gone from like the full city. Now I'm like in a like a really really suburban area. So I'm thinking this isn't gonna happen. I'm kind of like walking in circles right now. Let's see. I don't know about this. All right, I'm like on top of it, and nope, <laughs> no bike here. Man, that's a bummer. Well, I'm back to where the journey started and um, a little bit disappointed, but uh, I still think the line bike is an amazing, amazing idea. Uh, hopefully in the future we'll have it in Delray Beach and uh, definitely when we do I will try and check it out again. Um, again, great concept, uh, bad execution on the app part for saying that there's actually one in the area. So yeah, so that's it for today. Hope you enjoyed this. Uh, again, my name is Rebecca Meyer and if you're interested in seeing more content like this, make sure you hit that subscribe button and don't forget to ring the bell. Alright, we'll see you soon.